Hello everybody, I'm Blazer Rebecca and welcome back to Oliver's Wish. We just met a little cute child named Alfred. And uh, we had to take him back to his brother's place. Not really, even Uncle Francis said so. Huh? Something smells good in that bag. Huh? Oh. It smells like Uncle Francis is baking. What's in the bag? Cupcakes. Oh. It's a cupcake. A cupcake? He acts like that's a... Yeah, it's like a small cake. I made this, though. You made this? Looks tasty. You want this? Please? Why not? How can I say no to a cute face? Oh, yeah, exactly. How can you say no to that face? There you go. I just hope I don't get in trouble, though. Thank you. Alfred has eaten the cupcake. It's delicious, I love it. Thank you, Oliver. Thank you so much for getting me home. Sure, where's your brother? I pray God you know who that brother is, though. You're welcome. Just be careful. It's safer to wait for your brother at home than wander off alone, okay? Okay. Hey, Oliver. Yes, Alfred? Before I go, I want to show you something. What is it, Alfred? Where, where are you going? Here. Aww. Oh. Is this? This is my family photo. This was two years ago when I was taken in. I was only five. So you're seven? Yep. Wow, you're quite young. So what's your brother's name? Arthur. His name is Arthur. Arthur? Why do I feel like I... Huh? Oliver, are you okay? <laughs> Don't cry, Oliver. I'm here. It's okay. Who? Wh what? Oliver? A good night, Alfred. Huh? Wait! What's wrong with Oliver? Well, I think he just got some sort of strange memory back. Hello. Alfred, I'm home. Arthur! Where did you go? Huh? Didn't I tell I was going out for a walk? Silly Alfred. I wasn't gone for that long. It's not the only thing I'm upset about. What's the matter? Is he gonna say something? I know that face. Jay, I wonder why you know that face. Oh, wait. I've seen them somewhere before. Oh yeah, but other than that. But where? Nothing is making sense to me. My heart is aching. My head hurts. What's wrong with me? I couldn't sleep that night. My head was trying to take in what I saw. Blonde hair, green eyes, and a gentle smile. Where did I see that face? And who is that person to me? So many questions in my heart. I don't know if I should remember or not or not. Could my heart bear such a thing? I've already suffered too much from what I found on my body. A few scars and bruises. Some are old, some are new. Like a gentle sweet flower being beaten and broken from time. Oh, jeez. <sighs> Who am I? Who am I really? This is what I must find out. Arthur. I must remember that name. Chapter 2 Flashback Hmm. Interesting. A few days later. We need to find a kitty. A very pretty kitty. Speaking of pretty kitties, meow. I guess I have to go to the place.
literally no people are out. Wait a minute. Closed. Well, god damn it. Oh, hello. The owner is out. Oh, okay. Well, then what do I do then? Everyone's welcome. Nice to know. Man, I'm not supposed to go here. <laughs> away from me? How scary is a tiny little spider? Seriously. Tiny? Have you seen the size of that thing? Ah, friend, leave me a leaf alone, please. Oh. Please stop teasing him. Hello. Can I not talk to you? Okay. Where's Felly? Why not just confront Arthur? <laughs> Confrontation! No? Okay. Okay. Yeah, screw the outside world. Well, why should you not go back? Why do you- Why do that- Why do thou go? Closed, closed, closed. Closed. What's the sign say? The sacred place for fortunes. Have your fortune read. Oh, of course. Totally not suspicious at all. Welcome, gentle soul of the wind. I sense uncertainty inside your soul. Am I right, young man? Well, you're certainly not wrong. But yes, I can uncover your past life. Would you join me, young man? Sure. I don't know if this is gonna be accurate. Spirits is con sanctus. Well, can I can't even try and read that without cringing. <laughs> well, like not cringing, but like without slipping up. Ah, I see it now. It is crystal clear to me. You are troubled. You are lost, but cannot recall the reason. I see. Fragments of your past. My past. The past that was forgotten because of the scars you possess. Small remains of torture and misery. Your life was a living nightmare. Isolation, hatred, and misjudgment. These were the causes of your memory loss and pain. Also, I see a man and a woman. They had two children. Identical in features, but different in color and personality. My family? However, such anger and depression turned the man's heart cold. The mother, afraid of her children's safety, she spoke with a gentle tone. I'm sorry, children. I don't have a choice. Forgive me. Huh? The sadness and grief she felt in her heart. The beautiful blue eyes threatened to spill a ri river of tears. It can't be. The two were separated. One led a normal, beautiful life. The other was surrounded by misery and darkness. Ah, methinks I see a building. Unloved, dis desolated, and unfriendly. It was, it was known to have cared for children that had no family. Oliver, I promise that we will come back. Be strong. N no! Yes. 
missing boy and carrying scars and bruises of the faces full, full, full of hatred. You flee from the orphanage. You were scared. The pain was too strong. Please stop! You still fear your past, my child. The past that made you afraid was your denial of recalling who you really are, young man. You must overcome your fear and recall who you were. And since there is another, someone who may know of your past, perhaps fragments of it. One who has blue eyes and loves his big brother. Alfred? His brother, Arthur. He may be the key to help you unlock your forgotten past. You must remember, Oliver. Remember who you are. One thing, more thing, my boy. Bad times are only times that are bad. That makes no sense at all. Yep, just leave. It's like, nope. She's right. I was scared. I wasn't lost. I ran away. I escaped from the dreadful place. I remember now. That voice. The one that a fortune teller foretold. It was mother's voice. Why was I left at an orphanage? Did my own father hate me? The only way to find out is to meet Arthur properly, not to run away from my past. I have to know who I really am. Great idea! Can I save first? I'd like to find a cat or like go back to my diary and save. Can I go to the pub? No, of course I can't. Ah, of course I effing can't. I would like to find a cat, please. Meow. Okay. Well, I think I'm gonna end this part here, but I will see you in the next part. See ya!